and I freaking fall over my <laughs> Saturday, April 29th. Made it to Minnesota yesterday. And uh, Noah and I are just getting things all set up. It's turkey hunt this morning. We're in a spot I've never hunted. Noah's hunted this area and shot a couple birds right around here. It feels good to be back in Minnesota. We both got tags in our pockets, so we're definitely kind of hoping for a double here. So hopefully we can uh, get that on film for you guys and keep you tuned. So let's get after it. it set up last night so no one set the decoys back out it right now looks like it's gonna be a pretty good morning it was supposed to be already pretty windy but it feels really good right now clear skies so far and we're just kind of waiting on the first gobble i would expect us to hear it here shortly so we're set up now but honestly if if a gobbler is down in these woods and it seems like it's gonna take us down that way the weather it, it's going to be good enough for us to maybe make a move. So feeling good this morning, though. I think it could happen today. So we will see. We'll keep you guys tuned. Let's do it. That was a cross. You hear that one? I feel like whenever they roost it over there, they end up making their way to the tip here. So that, I like that.
it's been a long time coming for me. I've been wanting to shoot turkey for a while. That was awesome. That was terrible. And what a show. <laughs> and I freaking fall over in my <laughs> I was literally, I was starting to like tip backwards anyway, so I was like, yeah, this might tip over. <laughs> yes, dude. First out of state turkey. That's awesome. He's toast too. Oh yeah. You hell smoked him. I put it right on the base of his neck. Dude, I wanna shoot this thing like what? I don't know. I was trying I almost tried to I tried to hand him my gun at the end. Like it was fine. Like and then I just didn't it tick though? Yeah. Yeah, it clicked. I don't know what's going on, dude. Yeah, you might have to it would have been a pretty i mean that turkey well like, at first he stopped though yeah right there we could have we could have probably doubled but yeah that's all right oh dude he let's go we go come on baby finally. Uh, finally. yeah that did not come on earned dude we have hunted hard and walked a lot God. of miles and with the weather, we were like, we might as well set up the ground line. And I'm so glad that we did because we got to set the decoys out. And yeah, they never actually jumped at the decoys. But could you hear them spin? Just oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. That was freaking sweet. Dude. They were both just struck. I mean, right once, once they hit the corn, like the edge of the corn, it was like they just beelined. Yeah. Dude, yeah. I am. I'm shaking. I'm tore up right now. Dude, isn't that sick? Yeah, I've never had, I've, I've honestly never had some come into a decoys like that. I've seen it so many times that people do it and I'm like, I just haven't had the right scenario, but that was perfect. Oh, dude. <laughs> Should you go take a look at him? Yeah, we can take a look at him. Let's do it. Hell no, I'm not denying that. Let's go see him. Let's go do it. Well, what a hunt. I'm kind of speechless right now. That's that's one that I will remember for a really long time. Noah and I have worked our tails off and it finally paid off this morning. We had a break in the weather where it's still pretty windy, but the sun was shining and uh, this turkey read the script for us, came right into the decoys. They put on a show and I was able to shoot them at 15 yards, which was just awesome. Unfortunately, Something happened with Noah's gun where it wouldn't go off, but it happens. We're just super happy to harvest the bird together, and I can't thank Noah enough for guiding me these last couple of days, and for him and Tress's hospitality. It's just, just been great. It's just been an awesome trip. My wife, me, and my daughter will be heading back to Michigan, and uh, our turkey season actually starts next weekend, so... Um, we're gonna we're gonna get chasing turkeys back in Michigan, so I'm excited for that. But thank you guys for watching. We will see you on the next episode.